Hey Zesties, I'm Michelle May and welcome or welcome back to my channel Zesty Girl. It's school holiday so my day's running a bit differently at the moment. It's quarter past 12 and my, my husband's just gone to pick up my younger son from basketball and drop off my middle son to basketball because it's school holidays. Did I say that? I just said they're school holidays. Anyway, so I've been working all morning and now I take a break around lunchtime because they're swapping over and he'll, my little son will be coming home. So what I've been doing is taking a few hours in the day to do Sort of a cleaning project or a family project and I get to back to work for a few hours and then we do some things as family. So yesterday's tool was decluttering the bathroom so if you didn't see that you might want to watch it it's up here tonight maybe tonight we'll be doing a Costco haul it's a haul that I should have done last week but I've been holding off by using anything that I can find in the house. It's got to the stage now where I have to do it so before I do it I'm going to rearrange our pantry because our pantry has become such a mess in the last few weeks and the reason it happens is we've got six people all in there rummaging and trying to find things. Ultimately it becomes out of hand. So I'm going to be cleaning the pantry today really quickly. I'm also going to be doing a freezer inventory just to clarify that what I've got on my list is correct. Looking at the fridge, the fridge needs a clean. There's some areas of the fridge that are really dodgy. I haven't got time to clean the whole fridge, but I'll be doing the dodgy areas. So if you want to join me in this power clean, organize, declutter session on the pantry, preparation for a huge Costco haul, let's do this. Okay, so here we go. Messy, 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 messy. And the fridge. There's not much in there. This is uh, leftovers for boys, leftover for my daughter when she gets back from ballet shortly. My husband, what I'm going to make for my husband's lunch there. These to be eaten tonight. Got a few random lettuces in there. That's about it. And oh, some more lettuce. And a little bit of broccoli. These corn cobs, I haven't eaten the corn cobs, and they're still fine. That green yucky thing there is not mold, it's avocado. But they still look fine. Yeah, so I'm gonna go with them today somehow. And then that's it with like milk. This one's like a little bit in there, a little bit in there, so I'll make a smoothie. There's no cheese, there's no ham, there's no there's just nothing really. There's no dog food, there's just a lot of nothing. There's a few blueberries there, but that was, I bought that last week, probably remember. Okay, just who I need, just come home. How was it? Yeah, it was good. Was it good? Yeah, it was better. Why are you videoing me? Because I need you to help me do the pantry and you can pass the things out to me because it'll be faster. Is that okay? Are you tired? Yes. You're super tired? I've yes. got bacon wraps. Would you like a bacon wrap? Yes. Are you gonna help me, Ellie? Yes? No? Okay. I'm better with the ball in a situation. Mmm, mm, yum. They're good? Yeah. Good wraps. I'm glad you had a great time. It's hungry work, basketball. Do you want one of those street waffles? I've got a couple left. Oh, yes, please. <laughs> yes, please. Okay, so before we get started, Tom wants to show you his shuffling that he's just taught himself to do. Okay, go. Bad one. Oh, delete I thought it looked amazing. Delete that. It no. didn't. It didn't all come down. Okay, we'll try again. Okay, we're going to try again. Mmm, that was a good wrap. I don't normally have wraps, but it was really nice. Oh, wow, that is amazing. Right, let's get started. What game are you watching on the TV that you want to get back to watch? Lakers vs Heat. Lakers vs Heat. Right. We're on a mission. Okay, right. Come on, here. Yeah. You're gonna, I'm going to pass things to you. Oh, lovely. Here, okay.
Okay, so we've unpacked this from above. It needs above to be and all <laughs> above and beyond. Uh, I know I want those three things up the top. This is what this normally looks like. It has our canned foods. So what we're missing so much. Um, we've got cream corn there that I can't. I've been asking the children if I can make them corn fritters and they keep saying no, they don't want them. So we've got a couple of cherry tomatoes there. One coconut milk, two coconut creams and various black beans and there's lentils and kidney beans and cannelloni beans and mixed beans there. So plenty of beans. We've got three tunas which my younger son eats two at a time so that's not going to last very long. Up here we've got some sardines, my husband has those often for lunch and some pink salmon at the back. And then over here we have all our herbal teas in that which I'm sure I could arrange better if I could think about get a system for these but there's all different herbal teas that we go for at the back. And then our coffee, hot chocolate and chai latte. So all the different coffees for the coffee machine, tea. So that's our tea area and that's some gluten free biscuits that I forgot I had that I can give to my little guy when he gets home. No, not my little guy, my middle guy. Okay, I'm going to keep going, next shelf down. I wasn't going to, what wasn't I going to do? What was I not going to do? Oh, I wasn't going to clean out the medicine that we keep in the top of the pantry, but it was so gross I had to, so I've just stopped the camera and just done that. So we should be back in action now, Tombo. Up we go. What we end up with down here is we have green powder, we have uh, pearl barley, we have uh, potato starch, black sears, <laughs> black sears, black chia, black chia seeds, rice bran, rice bran, rice bran flour. We have cranberries and barley bran, uh, sushi rice, quinoa brown teff seeds that we put in our smoothies and we have some raw chia seeds at the back as well. Here we have slippery elm powder, um, bicarb soda, then split peas and buckwheat, lentils, bees and flour, and chickpeas, and something else there, and coconut flour, prunes, Corn flour, the gluten-free cake that the boys bought, black rice and gluten-free breadcrumbs. The very back I've got a big bag of coconut flour that we got cheap at Costco last time and we just haven't done any baking recently. And pitted, pitted dates, we've got enough pitted dates up the top. Okay, so I've pulled up these things. I've pulled up from the bottom the cacao powder because it's empty and needs to be refilled. The almond meal because I think I could fit that in the back one. The coconut, because I'm sure there's coconut here somewhere, which will need to be filled. 
hemp seeds because the hemp seeds are running out down there and walnuts so I'll now just go and repackage these into the containers up here so this is all the products that we use all the raw ingredients that we use here all these containers really need a good wash out and good clean they get quite because we're grabbing at them all the time and cooking with them they get quite grotty okay and we had a bit of a disaster in the back of that cover which I've cleaned up now and we're looking good we're getting there I try and use this level here for pots and pans um, I find that easier and so I'll just get that tidied up in a minute as well So hit me up, you know it's all I'm waiting for Oh would you hit me up, I've been waiting my whole life Oh for you to hit me up, I've never felt this way I want to turn back time, send me some heartbreak Okay, so we're down to so the last two minutes here. shelf there, got medicine and herbs up there. Okay, this is waiting on supplies, so we need a lot more tuna. Um, the beans and everything are okay. We need a lot of pasta sauce, like a lot. We need um, tomato sauce, we need, we need a lot. You'll see when I get it, a lot. Cereal, we need a lot of cereal. We need a lot of coffee. Nuts, everything else is pretty good. We need more bread. Everything's here. Need more rice. We've got no pasta at all. I just can need to clean this. It's a bit yucky. We haven't been buying protein powder because we had this one and it's taken us forever to get through it and no one liked it, but we've got through it so we can get some new protein powder finally. And then there's all our whole foods down there. Okay, so let's have a look in the fridge. Okay, so I managed to use some bits and pieces up today. So it's tofu, we've got one lot of cauliflower rice left, tiniest bit of kimchi left, and um, we can update some salsa, we've got some in the cupboard, um, some blueberries, there's half a yogurt there I think, one yogurt, cheese, I've made some wraps in case people get hungry this afternoon, some leftovers for my middle son. That's all we have. That's all we have. And I think there's some garlic. That's all cleared out. Used up one of those. And that's it. Oh, I'll show you this. I'll show you what's under the stairs now. So we need to bring out one of those. I've stored the extra one of those that I had. We've put the chestnuts here because we're not using them very often. And this co plain coconut water, we buy the box and it has flavoured ones. The children love the flavoured ones, but we use the plain one in our smoothies. Okay, we need, it's, we've got some of those in the pantry, but that's it. And then we've got, we need more almond milk. And then we talked about that before. We've got all the space here that needs to be filled and these ones aren't getting, getting eaten, 
in the snack drawer, which I'll show you. So I think I might use them to make like a nachos or I might just serve them up in the afternoon with hummus. So, And I've had to throw our hummus out. That was the only thing because it has expired. Okay, finally our snack drawer. This is our snacks for the children. Uh, what is this called? Granola bar. This is non-gluten free and gluten free here. So this is gluten free muesli bars. And these, what are these? Faba bean snacks. And then when the Atkins bars go there. And then some muesli bars, different ones. And then we have our popcorners and our veggie chips and sort of stacked in flavours. It's a snack drawer. We are having pork chops for dinner. We have, in the fruit, we have one orange leaf that I bought the other day. And we have some apples, because my son decided that they need, like they've got little bits. My son decided the other day that he only likes big apples. So these are little apples from Costco. So I'll make apple sauce to go with our pork chops tonight. And then we'll use up all of those. But we've got no fruit. No, I mean, you can do that. Okay, so thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Look at that. such a mess. That was a big job. That was a big job. I've been up and down and whew, that was a big job. <sighs> okay, so thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel. I'm off to Costco now and I'll see you on my next video.